like when in energy i get like a vision i okay. have to take it seriously so i was in last week was the divine mother's birthday okay and usually many sacred things during the spring moon will happen to okay. so i'll get a project i have to move forward with so i was asking my teacher yeah ultimate teacher um like he is ascended right even further than him yeah and uh, that teacher said my uh, vision for this year is to work with the water like oh, ley yes, line like you know, so, me that. so yeah. i was in the temple and and then i came home and my marriage pendant was cut off so it's like a very significant event because that happened on that mother's birthday mother portal's birthday okay so one of the thing i have to offer this this is the way i processed it i yeah. don't know whether it's correct or not but either i can lose my husband in physical body okay. he will be taken off on yeah. the other side or lose the system of marriage so i chose to take off the very thing so that it symbolically is end of one relationship okay continuing another relationship how is that in india how do indians like you know how do you, marriage marriage is actually a pendant okay. so it's like what it is is marriage in india is about being responsible for seven, seven generations okay so three generations above yeah three generations below okay and in the middle working as a partner but each one has to treat each other like royalty a king and a queen is what get married okay so one doesn't control the other okay in my household i don't have privileges even in my cooking area okay when the baby father is there he would say i'm not allowed to come in until he finishes his term so and that's why like you know i was asking um why well, I, i don't know that he is a white male so he told me today was it yesterday he said you should be so grateful i said why he says if you were in india you'd be beaten on the road side by the husband and i was oh. thinking that's his experience of indian women wow. and i said why I, he says when he visited india with me yeah it seems he observed because in india there is a very big drunken population okay the moonshiners oh, and cool. they take the money the mother made and beat them up on the road side wow and so that's who he compares it me to when i have gone to college put myself through take care of the family Raised and he still thinks he will be the yeah. one who is rescuing me versus i am providing for him even now that's, that's a space he's holding you know why why because you provide for him that's why because it makes him feel less of a man that's why because he see he doesn't really think of you like that that's what comes out of his mouth that's why he thinks of himself really because he because you provide more than he provides so he feels just you know what i mean but the problem is never that, admit that mm-hmm. you know but the problem is right when if you don't co-parent and again and again sabotage i think it's reaching a point it's not working for me yeah but so so but spiritually this is what happened so i think it's because actually there are lots of sacred things that happen what happened was the that the energy portal 41818 is a divine bowl mm-hmm. that's given i told you right the golden bowl they oh yes yes yeah so yeah. i was asking what is my portal and they said it's sacred waters okay and that night i registered uh like you know it's land donation to raise the temple okay and so i when i released the energy the priest like you know i said hey i donated it to you they have a temple in billingham okay on that night we were in new hampshire in the river i picked up a rock each rock has an energy right and that rock called out to me it had a big smile yeah yeah so then i was sleeping with that rock and then on that night i actually before i went to new hampshire i stopped at the indian store yeah and i got to um, oh, divide wow. actually it's supposed to be a prayer meditation okay 
is the uh, goddess of nurturing for sweet memory. Oh. So, but the the face was so cute. Like you, in some angle, it could see oh. like you know she had a smirk, she had a laugh. Like, right. You could see. Right. So I decided to wear instead of okay putting it in the shrine. Yeah. And that released some energy in me, a ferocious energy that came out. Okay. That corrects that situation. So the raw and this energy together saw what was happening and they decided to end it. Oh. They said it cannot continue. And because my teacher also gave me the project of what? water, yes. I felt I released something. Okay. It's the end of one cycle in my life. Okay. So my choice then is now that I know I can choose to end him mm -hmm. or in the relationship I hold with him. Mm -hmm. So I decided, okay, let me in the relationship, even though he doesn't understand, I ended up the relationship and he reacts still. So he's saying, instead of saying, okay, let's renegotiate, he's saying, get out. Right. So he's again and again coming from a space of entitlement, which is not going to be okay with the universe. Right. I'm just saying, like, you know, like right. I can see it. Yes. But I'm hoping as a provider and also nurturer, I will also bless his life so that Right. He would be safe. So night, right. I actually went and did blessing with my kids too. My mm -hmm. um, my middle one thinks that I'm out of back. So he was so upset that I was trying to bless him. Really? He says, I want to like not um, have any negative energy associated with all this conflict right. influencing them. Right. So like how you do saging. Yes. So I kind of like did saging and then also like, you know, blessing the house. Okay. And even then they think of that they are beyond my weirdness. So they have, uh, like, you know, the kids are heavily influenced. Okay. Yes. Oh, yes. I know. So they Children are programmed are... a different way. They're yes. brainwashed, you know. Yes. So that's fine. Right. But I still have to work from my spirit. So for my spirit, I'm negotiating with the other side. I said, please spare my family. Right. Don't punish them. Right. But like just like how Jesus said, you know. Right. Hey, yeah. put me in the cross, but spare my kids, you know. Right. So that's what I'm doing. I'm yeah. in the cross. Right. And I know I'm gonna have my resurrection. Right. But and I also feel I release too. I, yeah. I feel I don't need to live this life anymore. I don't need to live the same marriage anymore. No. So my marriage ended up and actually in India they call it Gandharva Swap. That is yes. the love never ends. Yeah. See, there is, I, what I decided to do is conditional to unconditional. That's all right. I'm transporting myself. Right. So the conditional part is on their end. Right. Their conditions is finance still. Right. You know, which is fine. You right. know, like uh, that's all they want from me. Oh my God, what a relief. Well, yeah, my spirit is still I mean, there. Like, you know, like what I'm saying is I didn't lose my soul. I didn't lose anything that I, is important right. to me. So right. I feel I have been given the world again. Yeah. So I can rewrite my history now. So I'm right. good with that. Yeah. But I still need to do it in a way for the world is safe. Okay. For them. Yeah. You know, see, because their right. world is me, you know. Of course, of course. So that's where I'm at. Crossroads. Okay. Hmm. It's a fascinating time in my life. Yeah, well that's and it's actually what I experienced, like you know, many many of my executive friends and I have like so many corporate friends. Yes. Sometimes they'll call me and say, when they have a challenge in their family, they'll say, hey, can you come have dinner with us, even that one hour with you, like, you know, this is so much effort. Right. And people value my time. Yeah. You know, awesome. because the problem solving skills I'm getting because of all this experience right. is tremendous. Right. So my ancient teacher, he said, don't run after the post, let the post run after you. So yeah. I think something is going to be preciously offered to me. Right. So I'm getting ready for that. Okay. That's, that's yeah. the way I think. Yeah. Like you know, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna yeah, get on, part. get on, yes. like a different way of working. Right. And I feel seriously, I feel I'm going to be a multi billionaire. It's yeah. just a matter of time. Yeah, that's the way it know, looks know. like. Yeah. Exactly. But at the same time, I feel the the ancient teacher said the only thing. In any situation, you need to change it, shift their thinking. He says that's the only way to win. So my answer is already given. Right. So it's like playing Chinese for uh, Chinese checkers. Yes. Say. Yes. So your idea is to go from this thinking yes. to the other thinking, while everybody shifts their thinking and still wins. Right. So 
that's what I'm doing. Chinese okay. checkers. And that's energy. cool. Have you ever done Chinese checkers? I haven't played. Actually, I don't know. It's like a, a uh, six star triangle. And you go from one portal. Ten marble you need to move from one marbles. side to the another. Right. Another okay. Side. Yes. I think I have played it before a long, long time ago. But I think I've played I, it there is a, In the past, I used to play only one level at a time. And we were in the vacation. Thank God I had the vacation. My my youngest one brought Chinese checker. And that's when I realized you can jump. Oh. Ten move jump. So when they are stuck in a thinking, I can jump three, six times oh. and reach my place. So I nice. didn't know I was given that option. Oh. So that kind of like released me tremendously. Right, right. So, so it cool. corrected my water body. Right. So I never cried. See, like all this is happening. It didn't even touch my heart. Wow. Wow. So uh, I cool. think that's a blessing. Yeah, that's a blessing by itself. Yes, it is. Definitely. That's cool. So I didn't have to like, see, if it had happened normally, like 20 years ago, I would have cried about it. I would have wasted right. 10 years. Right. I would have been bitter. Right. Imagine 10 years I could took back. <laughs> right? <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, yeah, because like what I learned from 1998 to 2008 is what I'm taking back in mm -hmm. 72 hours. Wow. Because this happened. April 19, 2018. Okay. And today is 23rd, right? Uh, 19, 20, yeah. 21, 22. Today's the 23rd. 23rd. Yeah. yeah. By 22nd, yesterday itself, I had my answer. So, 70, wow. 10 years equals 72 hours. Hey, did you ever bring your, your car thing? What? Did you ever get your car back? No, I got a new card. The thing is, like, you know, I feel I'm not going to be stuck on people who are doing the wrong thing. That's that's right. where not I'm going to waste my energy. Exactly. It's just money. Yeah. I, it doesn't matter. Money and like Dr. Do, he lost like millions of dollars. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so I feel like, you know, it's a little small price to pay about learning the value of human right. life. That's true. That's, that's, that's his true. value. Yeah, his value true. is $2,000. If wow. that's all it means to him, that's yeah. fine. Yeah. You know, two thousand like dollars a dollar nowadays you know, <laughs> but like what i'm saying is yes. if by chance you learn from somebody they're only worth two thousand dollars where do you want to hang out with i would rather work with priceless human beings right seriously you know why waste money Sometimes, like yeah who's that your son is it two thousand dollars no the guy who stole the car oh, the, oh yeah the car thing okay. my son actually see he's more. a part of my soul what i'm trying to do is I feel I don't want him to split his mind. He's a friend. Right. And I feel I don't want him to lose his future. Right. But at the same time, I need to correct his thinking like Chinese checker because I'm, oh, I am taking another funny. level of a motherhood. So I feel, I see excellence in all of them. Of course. And I have to bring them to the next level. Mm -hmm. So I am playing Chinese checker in energy with them. That's true. That's true. But yeah. I have to shift their thinking. Yes. So then the post will come later. So just like how my teacher said. Right. So I'm shifting their thinking, being responsible as a mother. Yes. But responsible as mother for four adult adult kids. Right. Like you know, meaning like two foster kids, which is my father and my baby father. Yes. And two, the one biological. Right. So that's the space I'm holding now. Divine okay. motherhood. Yeah. Hey. Do it. <laughs> oh, man. I feel happy though. Like, yeah, you know, I'm not well, like, I wouldn't ever regret this one. Of course. And of this course. is what is going to come as blessing to help millions of people, like, right. you know, including you guys. Right. And, you right. know, everybody's story, I'd be able to help more. Right. Definitely. I'm sure.